Hi guys, welcome to Simply Scuba. Here we have the Apex XTX200 XTX50 set. Uh, so this is a stage three set in that you get your primary and your octo already assembled. So all you have to do is you have to add a SPG, a submersible pressure gauge, and whatever low pressure inflator hoses that you want. Uh, so this is how it comes assembled. Um, so if you need it assembled in a different way, you're gonna have to tell us and let us know. Um, we're gonna take a look at the first stage first. So this is the FSR first stage, a decent chunk of um, chrome plated brass, uh, which means that it's great for cold water diving below sort of 10 degrees Celsius. So um, when you're diving in colder waters, you need a big chunk of metal to act as a big heat sink. Um, and this is gonna do it for you. So it's gonna work very well in cold waters. So this is overbalanced as well, uh, which means that as you go down, it's actually going to get a little bit easier to breathe. Um, so if anything goes wrong, it will give you plenty of air or give you more air than, uh, than you require. Um, at the top, you can see we have environmental sealing, so that's going to help you out uh, in the long run. One, it's going to stop contaminants from getting inside of the regulator, um, so it's a lot easier to clean, and also it stops those contaminants from getting inside, so uh, it doesn't affect the internal mechanism. So it comes in both A-clamp and DIN, this is A-clamp obviously. Um, and uh, you've got four low pressure ports, two high pressure ports, one on each side. Um, so it's a great sort of single, um, single cylinder set. Moving down from the first stage, both of your hoses are braided hoses. So these are much lighter and more flexible than a uh, traditional rubber hose. And they lead to your second stage. So I'm gonna look at the XTX200, which is your primary first. So, the XTX200 is very much the pinnacle of the, uh, the XTX range. Uh, as the air comes in, you can see we've got these little heat sinks. So these actually absorb uh, warmth from the water uh, and actually warm up or uh, sort of allow the coldness uh, of that uh, sort of rushing gas going through to actually prevent ice from forming. So, um, so it acts as a great heat sink, makes it really effective in colder, uh, colder waters. Now these second stages are ambidextrous. Um, so if you want, you can change the, um, the hose orientation. So whether the hose comes out of the right like this or the hose comes out of the left, depending on your preference or how you're diving, um, you can have a technician kind of swap those over and have that hose coming in from either side. Now on the front, we have a big uh, sort of graduated purge button. So the Apex logo in this sort of X shape. Pushing on any of that is going to, uh, to activate the purge, but it's handy because you can push a little bit and it will just give you a little bit of gas just to clear out a bit of water at the bottom. Um, or if you push it all the way in, it will give you all the gas it can uh, and really sort of clear it out. So this has two adjustments on it. You have an adjustable Venturi, uh, so that's gonna interrupt a free flow, particularly useful on your Octo, but you can have it on the uh, primary as well. That just interrupts free flow so they, uh, they don't occur. You'll get a little bit of a hiss, but it redirects the airflow inside of the second stage and just interrupts it so it doesn't form. You also get a uh, breathing adjustment uh, knob, so you can screw that in to make it a little bit stiffer to breathe, and then unscrew it to make it a bit lighter. Um, it's best when you're putting in storage to unscrew it as far as possible so there's less pressure on that seat um, just so your, uh, your second stage lasts that little bit longer. Okay, the mouthpiece itself, this is a Comfort Bike mouthpiece. So nice and small, fairly compact. You've got a little bridge over the, uh, the top here, which kind of holds it in position where you don't have to bite down on the mouthpiece. That way you don't get the uh, sort of jaw fatigue. And uh, everything in here has a, um, a special, it's been impregnated with an antibacterial um, sort of formula. So actually they stay cleaner for longer. They actively kill microbes and little nasties, uh, which is very useful. Um, if you're not sort of looking after your regulators quite as much, they're looking after themselves. So these have a removable exhaust T. So this is in the sort of wide configuration. You get a compact configuration um, and you can compare that to the Octo. The Octo has these fitted, but you can swap those over if you want. All you have to do is just push on that Apex logo and undo these two. Um, but all in all, the XTX200 is a fantastic um, second stage because it's got those uh, sort of metal inlays and whatnot, uh, just makes it more effective at cold water diving. Okay, onto the Octo. 
very much the same, uh, but you've just got the yellow details. Uh, you've still got the heat sinks, it's still ambidextrous. Uh, you've still got the adjustable venturi and the adjustable breathing. Uh, but this is the uh, sort of com uh, compact exhaust tee. That way the bubbles come out a little bit closer to your face, but um, it's up to you whether you kind of swap them over on the XTX 200. Um, the XTX 50 is a fantastic little second stage. It's a great alternate. Um, you don't get the Comfort Bike mouthpiece, but you do get their standard one. Again, much more compact, um, but you just don't get that little bridge over the, uh, over the top. But all in all, a fantastic set of regulators. Great for cold water diving um, and warm water diving alike. Uh, this is the Apex XTX 200 XTX 50 regulator set. Thanks for watching and safe diving. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.